In crisis at the border, thousands of Haitian migrants waiting to be detained by border agents. Governor Greg Abbott saying law enforcement along the border is overwhelmed. Our Bill Barajas live outside a Customs and Border Protection office in southeast Houston with the very latest. Bill? Well, as you mentioned, the situation at uh, the border right now is being called a crisis by officials there in Del Rio. Border Patrol agents, other federal agents, and local law enforcement all overwhelmed by the thousands of uh, migrants from Haiti that are seeking entry into the U.S. and seeking a better life. And you can see right there, there's a weird dam out my right side, and they're just going back and forth to Mexico. This is what the situation looks like from up above. Thousands of people carrying food, water, and ice to what has now become a tent city. 12,500 Haitian immigrants camped out at the U.S.-Mexico border just outside of Del Rio. You're going to have to start turning around. The situation forcing Homeland Security officials to shut down the Del Rio International Bridge and border crossing. The Del Rio mayor declaring a local disaster declaration. This is no longer sustainable, acceptable. What's happening now in real time is the, 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 the migrants are getting agitated. The Border Patrol can't keep up with, with feeding. Um, during lunchtime, the facilities, the quality of life, the standard of living is all being stretched beyond its capabilities. Texas Governor Greg Abbott calling out the Biden administration and signing a $1.8 billion bill funding border security in the state. The Biden's administration's open border policies have opened the floodgates to illegal immigration, to crime, to human trafficking, to drug smuggling. These funds will help the Texas Department of Public Safety arrest more people at the border. They will help the National Guard to secure the Texas border. They will increase funding to build the border wall. And the Department of Homeland Security said about 2,000 migrants have already been taken for that, from that camp for processing and removal. We're also told about 400 federal agents and local law enforcement are being sent to the area to help those already on the ground that, as we mentioned, are overwhelmed at this point. Live in Southeast Houston, Bill Barajas, KPRC, 2 News. Bill, thank you.